because agriculture causes uh, climate change, about a quarter of the emissions are due to agriculture, we need to find a way of producing food efficiently and with as low a climate impact as possible. And that's the work that we do. We do lots of, um, lots of computer modelling to work out, so we've got lots of people who take measurements and then we use computer models to work out at the global level what the impacts of on climate and greenhouse gas emissions are going to be from all the different types of agriculture and that's obviously very different in different parts of the world and we're able to quantify that, to aggregate that up and to work out the contribution to total climate change. So we've developed a, a greenhouse gas calculator which allows farmers and people who are, who are employing farmers, people involved, big agribusinesses, people involved in the food chain, to calculate greenhouse gas emissions from farming. So they are able to, to ask their farmers or instruct their farmers to use the greenhouse gas calculator to calculate the impact of all the farming and the different practices that they do. And that helps these big companies to identify where the, where the hotspots for greenhouse gas emissions are and to change practices to reduce those significantly. So it's being used in uh, many countries, over, over 40 countries in, in the world and tens of thousands of farms through these different big supply chains on a whole range of different products to allow them to quantify the climate impact and to reduce it. The United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change uh, commits us to reducing um, the, the temperature rise on the planet to about 2 degrees Celsius. It's used by the climate negotiators because we've quantified the contribution of agriculture to, to, to the climate impact. Um, they're able, when they're deciding on how to set targets for future climate change, to use that information to work out the contribution that agriculture will make to those climate change targets in the future.